It's interesting how time is an arbitrary concept, and yet we have made tools to measure it. And over the course of how time has progressed and we as a civilization have evolved, these very tools have become excessively nerdy and geeky. This just brings in the paradox of how we have a hard time choosing when there's way too many to choose from. But I think I have found the answer for you, because obviously I have found it for myself. Enter the Heritage Chronograph from Alma Artes. Alma Artes is a brand of luxury watches that design their products with the sensibility that goes parallel to Nepalese culture. This background, I feel, explains the philosophy behind the name. What I have come to discover is that Alma in Latin means to nourish, while as Artes means to make art. So I guess one could say that whatever the brand does is to feed our heritage. First impressions, I must say, is that this is probably one of the best looking watches out there. If that's a stretch, in our Nepalese market, for sure. That is a fact. People who obsess over color theory argue that brown and black don't go together. But the copper juxtaposed against a brilliant black sunburst style is something to stroke your chin and admire. The white minute markers running between the hours bring attention to the sundial, the 24-hour counter, and the chronograph, from which the watch gets its name. Essentially, a chronograph can be thought of like a stopwatch, and you may have noticed that the second hand is not moving. This is because it is the chronograph hand. For this example, if you click the pusher at 2 o'clock, you initiate the function and the dial will count how many minutes have elapsed. Click it again and the hands of the complication stop. Click it yet again to set it off, or click the pusher at 4 o'clock to reset the whole thing. Perhaps I'm a boring person for feeling a connection towards the Times New Roman font. But that is probably why I have fallen in love with how the painted details have been framed by the applied indices and crowned by the Alma Artist logo. From the all caps identity, to the miniature information saying that you can go for a swim with it, to the bold on the bezel. But if I had to complain about something, it would have to be the bezel. As you can see, this watch has been loved, in a one-sided love affair manner perhaps. Because the black is painted over the stainless steel, nicks and scratches appear easily. That being said, these are battle scars, and I love each of these flaws. The heart that beats inside is a Japanese Miura OS21, which is perhaps one of the better reliable movements out there. It is a quartz-powered movement that propel the hands to tell the time, and it is held in place by a backplate, which is my favorite quirk of the whole watch. You see, it is only when you're away from home when you do notice the value of home. The clean etching of Swambunath is a perfect memento. It is comforting to know that home is ticking away on my wrist, that it is close to my pulse point, and that it is close to my heart. So if you want to pick one up for yourself, head on over to their website, take a look around. Their new lineup of watches on the Melanie strap is just bomb. And if you have been on the fence about picking one of these up, they are understandably pricey, I hope this video has helped you. If it has, please like and subscribe. I have been Nervic, you have been awesome, have a good one.